Well, good morning, Jetty Rockers. Welcome back to Jetty Rocks Fishing. I'm out here this morning. I got my wife Amber on the boat. I'm Captain Mike D, and we're going fishing, y'all. I don't know what we're going to do yet. We're either going to go flounder fishing or shark fishing, or we may do both. We'll see how I feel when I get outside the inlet. So where we're going to go, but we're going to do something. So wish us luck, and hopefully we'll have something to show y'all real quick. Jetty Rockers. If you could, go ahead and go over to JettyRocks.com. You can check out some of these cool hats that we have over there. We also have some tackle available, and we will have more available soon. And also, guys, if you want to book a charter with me, you can book a charter there, because I am now running charters. So all my information is on that website, so go check it out, y'all. And you can be in your own, very own Jetty Rocks fishing video. I hope to see you guys soon out on the water with me. Let's get back to the video. Right, y'all well, we're at our first spot we're gonna try flounder fishing first see if we can't get a couple flounder hopefully while we're doing this we'll catch a couple croakers and stuff like that we use for shark bait later but that's the first plan Let's see what happens i think babe's already got a flounder she got something pretty quick let's see if that's not flounder what is that? it's a croaker it's shark bait it's a croaker that's a big croaker that's a big croaker that's a huge that's croaker a bait, right? yep yeah <laughs> All right, well. Like we got shark bait. Awesome. All right, cool. All right, first of all, y'all, I think I got me a flat one. Is it a flounder? I don't know, that's a big something. I know that much. Something, something just ate it. What? Yeah, it just got eaten. Whatever it was got eaten. Oh, come on, that was a nice size fish. Or was it a grouper? You're not gonna be able to fight it with that rod. I just want him to let it go. I don't care about fighting him. I just want him to let it go. Just want him to let what I had go. That was a nice fish too, man. It was definitely a flounder. And this thing. All he's doing is just holding it. That little hook ain't in there. Yeah, it is the big old Goliath. let go of it just want to let go of it oh my gosh <laughs> oh there he goes like no now he's just getting ready to go to the wreck no oh, come on just snap it I'm gonna be a while with this ah, here we go Look the king babe on this little rod? Yeah, I, th I think you oh, you hooked no. a small fish and then you got a king. Oh. That's what I think just happened. Oh, I'm gonna lose it on this little No, rod. just try your best. Right. And if you get him, it's a miracle anyway. What? <laughs> I can't, I didn't, wasn't even she was there. fishing for bait fish because we just set up to go shark fishing oh and God. as she was reeling in a bait fish. No, it wasn't reeling in a bait fish. I haven't even put the... I, something happened and she was just putting down a shrimp and this thing. Oh my God. But this ain't a bait fish. Keep doing it, babe. You might have something really good there. Oh, 
Let me get this out of the way. You're doing all right. If we get it, this will be a miracle, but we'll see. I think it's a cane or a bonita. I'll be happy with either of those. Yeah, that's what I think it is. With bonita? Yeah. I like bonita. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see what it is. It's definitely going to be a gaff fish, I'm sure. Okay, walk up this way. He's coming up this way. I can't believe you still got him hooked because you just got a little tiny hook and a little tiny leader. Don't go, go forward so there. It's going under. Yeah. I can't believe this, babe. I see him. What is it? I don't know. Yeah, I just seen a flash. Keep going. It's a king. Oh my God. I think. No, it's a bonita. Oh my God. It's a big onita. It? Yeah. Shark bait. We're not going to eat him? Oh, we'll try. Oh. Reel up a little bit more. Okay, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Oh. <laughs> oh That's crazy. All right. Oh, it's so pretty. Yeah, it's pretty. Oh wow. Let's get him. Can I take a picture with him before yeah, you? Yeah. Oh, oh my god. Oh, oh. oh wow. Hold on. See if I can get him with a net instead of gaffing him. Hold on. See if I can get him with a net without gaffing him. Oh, so oh. You better get him for you, Liz. Oh, oh yeah. Oh. Got him, babe. That's crazy. That's crazy. All right. That's nuts. On a shrimp. Yeah. Wow. All right. It's the biggest fish I've caught in a long time. Yeah, it's a nice little bonita, babe. It's a nice bonita. Cool. All right. Get that hook off me. All right. Okay, Can you try that again? just put that in the rod holder. Huh? Put it in the rod holder. Okay. And uh, take a picture. All right, oh, we, that's something. Pretty neat. All right, y'all, like I said, we gave up on the flounder. Every time we'd hook into one, a Goliath would take it. So instead of going to another spot looking for flounder, we just went ahead and set up for sharks. And while we were catching sharks, Amber caught a nice bonita. So she's happy. So, we'll see what happens. Oh, we just hooked up with a shark. Yep, we hooked up with a shark. Go, oh, reel, reel, reel that other one in, babe. Okay. Then I'll hand this to you. There we go. Right here, here we'll, sw we'll switch. shark we got a shark and we got chaos all right get this out of the way all right all right y'all we have a shark on it took five minutes if that which way is he going well yeah i put all that blood that was in the bucket for the bonita in the water which way is he going? I think he's coming right to the boat. Alright. Come up, actually come up above me. And that way so I can get behind you. Alright, All right, keep fighting him. There you go. There you go, babe. Yeah, just let him do his thing, baby. Let him do his thing. There you go. There you go. I ain't seen him yet. Babe caught one croaker when we went flounder fishing. And I cut it in half. This was the other one half of it and I had another half out. So we got one bait left. Unless we can catch another one. Let's take, you got him? Yeah, it's still there. <sighs> I don't even see him yet. There you go. Don't let him get on that. There you go. There you go. Keep him out that way. Oh. All right. 
Keep going. All right, where's he going? All right. Hey, I see him now. It's a nice size shark, babe. I see him now. We see him now. All right, here he comes. What is that? Okay. All right, let's keep going. You got it. I can't. Well. <laughs> oh, I just made it. I just. You okay? Oh, my hands just hurting really bad. You want me to get it? Yeah. No, you got it, babe. You almost got him beat. Just give me one good gaff shot on him. different rod this is just a regular spinning rod oh you know what i never changed it over it's still right-handed that's, that's what why the... i'm having a hard time yeah <laughs> yeah it's still right-handed from my clients okay it's, it's killing me yeah i know babe sorry yeah and he switched that over here he is here he is i can't do it okay hold on hold on <clears throat> Trying to rush. I'm trying. Trying to rush. You yeah, almost got him. Come here. Right here. You got it, babe. Okay. Yeah, I forgot to change that over. Sorry. All right. Well, we got a shark. A nice size black nose too. Nice size black nose. Get our drinks here, babe. Yep. All right. All right, guys, we got a shark in the box. Sweet. Well, y'all, that didn't take long at all. We literally been at this spot 20 minutes exactly. And first drop, Amber got a nice bonita. But then not even 10 minutes after that, we got a really nice black nose shark. Was perfect eating size shark for me. Those are awesome sharks. So we can get one more great. If not, it's already been a great morning. But we're gonna uh, stay here for a little bit longer, see if she can catch a couple more croakers. But she only got one when we were fishing for flounder, and that's what we're using for bait. But so far, that's all we've needed. I can't complain. Oh no! Oh, something's trying to get it. Oh! Something ate your bait. Oh. <laughs> so it's not funny. <laughs> that's what we want, though. Yeah. Get, we want we want we want them to be feeding like that, but we need bait was first. It a yeah, that was a shark that grabbed it. 100. percent Yep. yep. <laughs> All right, y'all. This is the shark setup that I'm using. I'm using a four ounce weight to a swivel. I got about two and a half foot of steel leader to an eight aught circle hook, and that's what we're using to catch the sharks. Right now, we gotta wait for some more bait. We like to send another bait out. All right, guys. I just caught a little silver trout, and I'm gonna send him down for bait, live bait. It's getting chunky out here, so I don't know how much longer we're going to be able to stay out here. But what I like to do is I'll hook the bait right, right in the shoulder part. Just like that. And then I'm going to take my knife, if I can find it. And then I'm going to cut his tail so he acts really injured. Just like that. So now he is going to be flopping around there. Blood's going to be coming out of his tail. And I promise you, it's not going to take long. Real quick, I'm going to go over the regulations for sharks. What we're targeting is black nose shark, and they are considered a small coastal, and there's no size limit on small coastal sharks. And that is your Atlantic sharp nose, your black nose, your black tips, your bonnet heads, and your fine tooth. Those are all considered small coastals, and they don't have a size limit. But you allow one per person or two per vessel, whichever is less. On your larger sharks, like your bull sharks, like nurse sharks, spinner sharks, they have a 54 inch 
minimum size limit. So they got to be 54 inches to the fork from the nose to the fork of the tail in order to keep them. And then you have your hammerheads, which are prohibited. You can't keep hammerheads. Lemon sharks, you can't keep. They're prohibited and stuff like that. So make sure you check out your, your shark laws, your laws on shark fishing. Oh, we're getting ready to get bit right now. Oh. All right, we're bit, we're bit, we're bit, we're bit, we're bit. That didn't take long. Told you it wouldn't take long. There we go. That took all, what, a minute? Yeah. A little bit bigger shark, I believe. I'm gonna have to hand it to you when I get them close. Where's the gaff? Gaff's over there. Where's the gaff? It's right over here. I can grab it. Let me land this one, y'all. This will be our our two per vessel, one per person. And we're going in, we're going in the river. If it's a harvestable shark, it may not be. It looks like a black nose from here. It looks like a black nose. Oh my gosh. Getting a little rocky out. Yeah, we get this done, we're gone. Unless it's a good size. Yeah, it's a good one. It's a, it's a black nose. It's about the same size as yours. Watch out. Go ahead and put that rod up in the rod holder for me, please, baby. Oh, Golly, what are you doing? Huh? There he is. I'm gonna need your help here soon. Is a little heavy. Gosh! Oh. Alright, I got him. Alright. Alright. That one's a little bit bigger. Maybe a little bigger. Yeah, it's bigger. Yeah, that's a decent one. High five, oh. babe. Alright. Well, like I was saying, about two per person. These are black nose sharks i'll show you why they call them black nose these are perfect eating size sharks much bigger than this you know i really don't like keeping them too much because basically they're top predators but these right here are perfect size their meat's not too tough and it tastes great all right y'all well, i hope you guys enjoyed that video we just came out for a real quick trip started off fishing for flounder every time we hooked up with one there's a local Goliath that sits at this wreck that I like to fish and he likes to eat everything you hook into. So we didn't get nothing past him. So we moved, decided to come out here and shark fish. They've got a nice bonita dropping down a shrimp to catch bait. And we end up with two nice black nose sharks. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for hanging out with us and watching our content. We appreciate you guys very, very much. You guys mean the world to us. 
See you guys on the next one. Tie lines, y'all.